yourself. Just wait. I knew you were going to do something like this. There it is. Yeah. I hate to do it, but I hate to disappoint. Yeah. 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 here tonight. They came in from Santa Fe and uh, my partner Bill Chafe for his uh, hard work. This is the California Riviera, just like in France. So it's about health, nourishing, colorful food. Very, very, people are flavor seekers now. So they like big, robust flavors. From all the um, buffets tonight, you can say that everybody's really packing a lot of flavor. Can you put the there we go. There we go. <laughs> Thank you. As a restaurateur, we have a great relationship with all of our farmers. I even have two different farmers that deliver to my restaurant two times a week. So we get to work around the season, such as, you know, heirloom tomatoes are in right now. So we're, we're serving heirloom tomatoes, Vidalia onion salad. I think the trends now are coming from molecular gastronomy, kind of like when chefs do like caviar at a lettuce or doing kind of little weird things and using jellies and whatnot, what have you, and get back into the using food in its simplest form and treating it as its own ingredient instead of turning it into something. What I'm seeing now coming to the foreground is uh, sort of our own artisanal, an appreciation of artisanal charcuterie, uh, where people are doing their own in-house salumis or prosciuttos or anything along those lines, as well as buying whole animals and processing the entire thing themselves. Not only utilizing the more common cuts of meat, like the rack or the loin of a pig, but also using the feet, the, the head, the tail, everything that's coming, a real nose to tail eating. All right, all right, thank you, very happy. I think the secret to keeping savvy diners coming back and, and your customers repeating is just really what we do here, we really go by it and we have the saying that we're in the pursuit of excellence here at all times. Everything we do is about being excellent and giving the guests the best experience we can um, from just when they walk to the door, the greeting on the telephone, the greeting at the front door, the way we make them feel, just that they really have a great time. <laughs>